integral involving a secant function. So we have the indefinite integral of the secant of sine of 4x times the cosine of 4x dx. So the idea is to turn this uh, into simply a secant function so we can use the formula for the integral of secant. So we'll start by making a substitution. We're going to call this u. So this will be our u. So u is equal to the sine of 4x. And we'll compute du. So du, well, the derivative of sine is cosine. So this is cosine of 4x. And you have to multiply by the derivative of the inside. That's the chain rule. So the derivative of 4x is 4. And then you have the dx. So to finish, we have to make this look like this. So we have a 4 here. So we have to divide by the 4 to make this match this. So divide by the 4, so this is 1 fourth du is equal to cosine 4x dx. All right, so what do we do? We called this u, we computed du, and made this look like this. So now we're ready to make the substitution. So cosine 4x, that's 1 fourth du, so I'll write it over here, 1 fourth du. And then we're just left with secant of u. Secant of u. All right, when you integrate secant with well, 1 4 times out, you get the natural log, absolute value, secant plus tangent of u. But u is sine 4x, so it'll be secant of u, which is sine 4x, beautiful stuff, plus tangent of u, when u is sine 4x, right out of room, plus c. And that's it.